What's up, Internet? Welcome to Epic Meal Time. We've got an awesome meal plan for you guys today. I hope you like it as much as we like putting together the recipe for you guys. So let's jump in there and get crazy in the kitchen like you know how we like to do. Was that weird? What the f*** was that? Thank you, Internet. We made some burger sh** and it's gonna be fucking chill. And then we're gonna eat it. I don't give a fuck if you like it. If you want to make some dough quick, send your most resourceful buddy into the streets with various powder. There you go, quick dough. Making a big pile of bacon for this meal, throw it in your oven until it's cooked. How long until it's cooked, man? I don't know. I don't give a fuck. Mix the ground beef, eggs, barbecue sauce, and breadcrumbs into a bowl. It might not make sense now, but it will. Like Rob Thomas and Santana, smooth. We made meat blankets. You make meat blankets at home. You can use a bit more meat. Turn your meat blankets into meat snuggies. Because Snuggies are just blankets with sleeves, so we're making sleeveless meat blankets. What am I talking about? Make sure you drain the fat water off your meat every 20 minutes, if you know what I mean. Go, go, go. Ah! There's a Montreal painting to get on. Hold on. Custom dough laid out on the table. And here's all the ingredients we're getting down with today. It's a full house in this kitchen. In our burger bar, we put our first patty down. This will be a pizza burger, which is also the name of one of my Italian German buddies. Second burger patty, Tex-Mex burger with chili, sour cream, and cheese, and jowies on this motherfucking patty. Then our last burger patty, not to be confused with Patty Burger, a German female Olympic wrestler. Keep this burger patty classic. Lastly, we use bacon as a mold to hold this burger house together. Now this is the most delicate process as the dough would be what sells the final form of a... Okay. And we fucked up. Alright, maybe if we put it in the oven, nobody will realize that we botched it a little bit. Whatever. We had good intentions. We set out to make a burger bar, and you know what? We ended up with a burger pouch instead. What the fuck is still sicker than all your grandma's cooking? Because life ain't easy. Hey, sometimes things fall apart. One burger bar collapses. A burger pouch erects in its place. Next time we eat a chocolate lab, and I ain't talking about a dog.